Yo, yo, yo. One more. Yo. Fam, today, if you realise, firstly, before I get into it, make sure you like and subscribe. But if you've realised, I was using resistant bands. Well, I've got resistant bands and I'm using them today. So, I've done three. I warmed up, obviously, and I can skip again. My knee feels better. So, yeah. Anyways, I warmed up. Then I did three sets of five pull-ups with the thicker bar, wider ones. And... Yeah, I did five reps. I managed to do five. That's because um, I had the resistant band in it. Like before, after three, mate, if I can do one more, lucky. But yeah, the resistant band helps a lot. And I feel like it makes your muscles engage more. Please do not blow over thing. Wait, it's windy, guys. Wait a second. Wait. But yeah, you engage like a lot of your muscles more and it just feel, it feels harder, like you're more tired. You have to push harder. And with the push, you can push through, but without the resistance band, I'm not saying you can't push, but you can't really push through. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, it's a bit, it's a bit harder to push through if you don't have resistance band, because it's like, there's no support. But with the resistance band, there's support. Do you get what I'm saying? Obviously, guys, I cut my hair. I was always gonna say. I just forgot to say because I forgot. I cut it on Saturday. It's Monday today, but yeah, I cut my hair. And yeah, guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. We're gonna go on to close grip chin up pull ups now. We're gonna do that. We're gonna do that with some dips. And I'm gonna use the resistant band again. So I'm gonna try pull my. Uh, I want to get higher. I want to really pull it. I don't want to just do chin and down. I want to really pull and down. Pull down. Yeah, man, I want to work. No more talking. Make sure that comes subscribe. Let's go. Oh. Guys, I promise you my um, biceps are burning because you can get more of a squeeze in it and you can do more reps with the um, resistant band. So it's always going to be harder. I feel like now I've done, I did six reps first, then five and five. And fam, I felt it much more in my arms. I see why resistant bands are important, innit? But my thing is, yeah, how do you improve if you use resistant bands for support? Like, what, is it because you're able to do more reps in the future, once you stop using them, you're going to be better because, because you're, you get what I'm saying? Or, I don't know, to me, I get it, but at the same time, I don't get it. Cause it's like, if I can only do six dips, say, without the resistant band, but I put the resistant band on and I can do 10 dips, where, when is it gonna close? So from me doing six to resisted 10, when is that gonna close? So what in the future, is it gonna be me being able to do 10 without the resistant band and then 15 or 16 with the resistant band and then 20 to 26 or something? Do you get what I'm saying? Same as pull-ups. What, is it gonna start from say five now, four now? Yeah. And in the future, it might be 18 without it and 20 something with it. Do you get what I'm saying? Is that how it works? because I don't know how it works properly. But I'm gonna go into some dips now. Should I, I'm gonna use the resistant man. I don't know how to hold it, but I'm gonna, I don't know how to put the resistant man on for dips. But let's go.
Guys, I finished. I'm back home. And yeah, man. The workout was good, you know. It was good. It was hard, but it was good. And fam, one thing I've realised, yeah. Fam, using the resistant band helps so much. But my thing is that I want to know. How do you improve? Like, where where is the progress made while using the resistant band? Do you get what I'm saying? Like, right now, my shoulders, arms, biceps are cooked. Yeah. And I feel like that's because I used the resistant band, so I was able to do more reps. Do you get what I'm saying? But if I stopped, if I didn't use it, I would be still where I was before. So how would I improve when I'm not using it? Do you get what I'm saying? Guys, my hair's short right now. I literally quite uncertain it. I know I've started brushing it. The waves will come. Right. They will come in it. But yeah, guys, what do you call it? I want to know how, like, where you improve, like, what changes blah do you get what i'm saying i'm gonna try to go to this outdoor gym three times this week but my main thing is i want to know how it how it helps um, apart from supporting you because of course it's going to support you do you get what i'm saying like you're doing something with a support it's normal resistance but my thing is you're not fighting the resistance you're with the resistance so how does it help you get stronger do you get what I'm, i know it sounds it probably sounds stupid to you guys that understand it but I don't understand that people. I understand fitness, yeah, blah, blah. But it's like, if someone helped you push something, how are you going to get strong enough to push it by yourself? If you, if if all they're doing is helping you push it. Do you get what I'm saying? That, that's how I see it. Obviously, you guys in the comments are going to say otherwise and blah, 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 which is calm. But like, the question of the day or the question of the video is, how does a resistant band help you get stronger? Because... Is working with you to do the rep, basically, instead of fighting against you to do the rep. It sounds silly, but that's what that that's the truth. But yeah, guys, I'm gonna try to go three times this week. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys tomorrow. No, Wednesday. In a bit.